Hi guys, so we're back with another video, this time focusing on upper body dynamic conduit day. Uh, so the first thing we start off with is your standard bench press, early 77 kilos. We're going to do eight sets of three reps on this as well. So we're going to have a really low eccentric movement and then we're going to explode the bar off the chest. As you can see when I sit up here, I like to have my hands on the bar, go a bit further than the bar and then push myself forward and push my shoulders into the bench to get as much arch as possible whilst keeping my hips uh, glued onto the bench. So as you can see, I've been down nice and slowly and then push off. And down really slowly, push off as quickly as possible. You can see that speed's really in there. That's one of the main things we're focused on here. As much as we are focused on volume as well. So here's the last rep as well, like I showed you last time, the comparison between the two. Um, and here's my setup as well. So the reason I like to push my shoulders uh, into the bar, into the bench, sorry, is that it, I really feel like it allows me to get loads of power while I'm performing the bench lift. Really help me get activate that leg drive as well uh, and help me keep tight as well. Obviously different cues work for different people, but that's what's really worked for me. Here we are, just the last rep. As you can see, I managed to keep the speed up really for all of them. We then went on to pin press. Now we did have a bit of problem with pin press as to have the pins at the height we wanted to, we couldn't uh, actually unwrap the bar. So we had to start on the safeties, which was a bit of a pain really, because it meant you couldn't get it set up properly. As you can see here, my setup is much different to uh, how I was feeling, which isn't ideal, but we still managed to get three reps there in 140. We then jumped to 160 and you can see here how much of a pain it was getting set up. Uh, it really wasn't ideal, but you just have to get it done sometimes with these kinds of things. So here we can see with 160. Again, you see that arch isn't as much again. The first rep felt awful on 160. That second rep felt really good. And then the final rep again just felt awful. You can see the bar's not perfectly straight, a bit of an angle. And then I jumped to 180, which was a bit of an ego jump, and it was just a farce, really, again. As you can see, the bar's not even really straight. Um, I'm not set up very well. It was just a bit of a, a nightmare, really. Um, we then went on to um, 10 reps and five sets of incline bench at just 60 kilos. Just working on that volume, um, getting different parts of the chest moving. So here we do usually work on a different part of the chest that we don't usually do and the shoulders as well. Um, so there we are just doing the incline. I've not done incline with a barbell for a while, so it did feel a bit weird, I'm not gonna lie. And as you'll see in a second, I do miss the rack. So uh, Ben had to come and uh, rescue me. Uh, last thing we did was just three sets of three on pull-ups. Just nice and easy working the lats and that was it for the uh, workout. So if you enjoyed guys remember to like, subscribe and ring that notification bell and I'll see you in the next one.